an investor pitch lesson from my toilet. My toilet wasn't flushing again. I would push the handle, watch the water fill up the bowl, and then it would stall out. Three weeks prior, there was a block in the line from the apartment complex to the sewage system. Because the symptoms looked the same, I assumed it was the same problem. I called the property manager. She contacted the handyman. The handyman came to my apartment and snaked the toilet, but it still didn't work. He said he would come back the next day with a snake with a camera on the end to see if there was a block in the line. He said he would also bring a new toilet just in case. That night I received a voicemail from the property manager. She said she contacted a plumber who would be there the next morning. The plumber walked into my bathroom, looked at the toilet and said, I already know what the problem is. There was a calcium buildup covering the blowhole at the bottom of the toilet. He used a small tool to clean the blowhole. He flushed the toilet. Perfection. Five minutes to do the job. Here's an investor pitch lesson from my toilet. Because I was so focused on what I assumed the problem was, I convinced myself the problem was bigger than it actually was. It wasn't until a fresh set of expert eyes reviewed the situation, then I realized the problem was right in front of my face and it was a relatively easy fix. I just didn't see it because I was operating out of habit. I wasn't looking for it. The same goes for your investor pitch. If you feel like you have good content, but something isn't quite working, you may have a block that's preventing you from presenting your information efficiently and it may be a relatively simple fix. You just don't see it because you're in the thick of it. If you want a set of expert eyes to review your investor pitch, let's set up a quick call. We can talk about what's working and what isn't, troubleshoot potential issues, and discuss how we might work together. Be brilliant.